A massive asteroid more than four times the size of the beehive is hurtling close to Earth. The speeding ball of space rock will pass just 319,000 kilometres away. It's a very short distance in space terms. But don't panic, it's not going to hit us yet. Tova O'Brien reports. When Hollywood does asteroids, it goes for maximum impact. It's what we call a global killer. The end of mankind. The reality is slightly less edge of your seat. It's called 2005 YU55 and it's more of a treat for stargazers than the end of the world as we know it. How much of a threat is it to Earth? Well, it's more of a threat than most because it has an orbit very similar to the Earth. This is the closest approach by an asteroid that large that we've ever known about in advance. The space rock is travelling within the Moon's orbit at a speed of about 13 kilometres a second. And according to NASA, there's a 1 in 10 million chance it could hit the Earth in the next 100 years. Most likely it would hit uh, water because most of the Earth's surface is water. Uh, that being the case, there would be one uh, tremendous tsunami that would travel many times around the Earth. YU-55 will not be visible to the naked eye, so telescopes around the world are being readied for 1228 on Wednesday afternoon for this rare close encounter between Earth and rock. Tova O'Brien, 3 News. Don't be fooled. This asteroid isn't moving slowly. It's in fact careering towards Earth at unimaginable speeds. It won't hit us, but it's got astronomers across the world very excited. This is the closest approach by an asteroid that large that we've ever known about in advance. This is its path, travelling inside the Moon's orbit, coming within just 200,000 miles of Earth. In effect, it'll be moving straight at us from one direction and then it'll go whizzing by and straight away from us in the other direction. So it's, its motion across the sky will be close to 180 degrees over the course of less than two days. The dense carbon rock is 400 metres wide and has been tearing around space for thousands of years. It'll be a rare chance to view such a beast from the ground. Radar telescopes in the States are preparing for its flyby on Tuesday night. If this asteroid were to hit Earth, it would have the power to destroy London or create a 70-foot high tsunami.